Hello everyone, welcome back to our lesson. So we continue about the topic of looping or repetition. So today we are going to continue this with the sentinel control. Sentinel control unlike the counter control, which means you know how many times they are going to repeat for the same program. Sentinel, we don't know when you say it's going to stop, but we give the condition to stop the program. Let's begin with the IPR analysis. So we do the program for calculate and display BMI. For an example, the program stops when a weight of zero is entered. Let's do the analysis for the problem statement. Calculate and display BMI. So for type of control structure to be used for this problem statement, when we say that the program stops when a weight of zero is entered, it means that the BMI will be continuing calculate until the user key in the weight is zero. So what type of control factor to be used? Yes, it is sentinel control for the repetition because a weight of zero to exit the program. Okay, let's see how are we going to write the IPO analysis. It is slightly different for the step of process. Okay, what are the inputs to calculate the BMI? I hope you still remember which are the height in meter and weight in kilogram. And the process determine BMI based on height in meter, weight in kilogram, until weight equal to zero. Because stated there, weight equal to zero to exit the program. So the output is BMI. So this is the IPO analysis to calculate and display the BMI and the program will exit when a weight of zero is entered. Okay, thank you very much and see you on the next lesson.